What is going on, Lunatics? Hope you're having a great morning. My name is Bleeze, and we're here to talk about the Luna Classic price. Now, uh, I know most of you have been looking at it, seeing it ranging in this really low sort of area. We're going to look in on that, and we're going to talk about it. We're going to try to make this pretty quick because not a whole lot going on. Happy Fourth of July, by the way. So let's go check out the price action, and let's see what is going on. As you can see right here, we're just kind of ranging in this. We're just kind of bouncing around on the 50 SMA. 200 SMA is starting to come down. I wanted to bring these back into Vogue, and I wanted to go back to the MACD for a little while so you can see how this whole market seems to be moving. Now, uh, there's not a lot of money to be made in this range right here unless you are willing to do some very, very high risk. If I just give you an idea here, from $1,000 moving from 86 to 87 or 88, that's like 10 to $20. Not a whole lot of money being made here, uh, so this is uh, th this is a, an incredibly tight sort of range. You have to have a large amount of capital that you're doing in here for a couple of hours, for a couple of hundred dollars, uh, just to make anything. So this range will not make sense for much longer. There's going to be a breakout. Uh, that'll happen. Uh, as you can see over here, there's just been a, there, there's a, the, a much bigger range that's happened before. And and you know taking this out for these little uh, catastrophic sort of events, uh, you really look in this tight channel right now. So uh, there's going to be a break one way or another, going to be an opportunity. Uh, I do think that it starts to break to the upside very, very shortly. And the reason for that, of course, is you, uh, USTC, which uh, the approval was done for the repeg, so I think that we're going to see a spike. Now we did see a spike up to 1.35 cents, which is kind of a big spike when it when you look at it from a dollar uh, value. And a couple days ago, when it first got announced, it went up to uh, point, uh, 0 0.15. Again, another big spike. Uh, that was a range, uh, a very quick range of about 23 percent. But we're going to see some real real moves pretty soon and as we get up here we're gonna be looking at three and four and five cents uh in 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 due time but it's coming pretty soon i think so you know just bear bear that in mind and then also over here uh 29 million in trading volume down a little bit uh it is fourth of july in the united states so uh may not be you know uh, it might take a little bit uh but 507 million in market cap still maintaining a half a billion dollar market cap Still in the top 100, uh, just just a, a gigantic number. Still, um, the the spike up here, seven million in trading volume on USTC because of you know people are starting to feel that there's something happening under the surface here, and it will start to pay off. 123 million in uh, market cap for USTC, and then finally over here, uh, we have reached a 15 percent stake ratio. So it's a pretty big number. Uh, I think that that's going to mean it's going to be the price action. Uh, again, we're going to have a, a tight price action for a little while, but I think this is going to break and we're going to start to see a lot more volatility coming uh, a lot sooner than later. But let me know what you think in the comments down below. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell to be notified of future content, leave a comment down below. It's not financial advice. My name is Blaze. I am always right. Thank you so much for tuning in and we'll talk to you again very soon.